I've been wanting to see what this new black metal armor support can actually do for dragons. Make sure you guys smash the living crap out of that subscribe button so you guys don't miss out on more Oz content. Now this is always very interesting to see because remember Metal Morph just got its new version and we got the red eyes that could search it. So what happens when we incorporate this new technology on in to Dragon Link? Well, you get quite an interesting spectacle here. We are against Gimmick Puppet here. Ah, so the battle of, you know, the infinite BS storm, my favorite. So be starting off, you standard link out the black metal on into the Striker Dragon, and you're kind of off to the races. But you know what's really funny about this? We can search for the Red Eyes Black Full Metal Dragon off of this because it has Red Eyes in the name. I think that is the best part about this. Hey, look, we have our Omni set up. <laughs> That's beautiful. And we got our free boot sector launch off of this. Oh, beautiful. All right, there's the Red Eyes Darkness Metal. Revive. Make Rom. Rom, go ahead and grab the Dragon Ravine. Very standard place. Deploy the Ravine, discard, mill off Abzo. Abzo gets us a free rocket from the deck. All right, go ahead, cover it on into the sector, special. Go ahead and buy steal away our red eyes. All right, go ahead and trigger the effect for the end phase. All right, there's the Dispater, Striker coming back. Go ahead and make the Heavenly Spheres. And then we're gonna go activate the Full Metal Dragon here, which lets us reveal it in the hand to go search for the Enhanced Metal Morph. And then this dips back on out into the deck. All right, mission accomplished. And then we get a free Baldrake here during the end phase. You know what? We did pretty gosh darn good there. Like, that's what this deck wants to do. You know, having Pater set up, having the Heretic Heavenly Spheres. Um, our opponent's got some gas here, though. So let's see what they can come up with here. So main phase, Msedi, go ahead, do the thing. Go ahead and grab everybody's favorite King Sarcophagus here. All right, they're going to go ahead and pop it away. Three very good cards here. I mean, we're getting down the Biscay, the Rogue, and the Terror, baby. Uh, not my favorite combination of friends in the world, but that's fine. Go ahead and get our recurability back. That's fine. We're going to boot uh, the boot sector back to our hand. Spheres, go ahead and special summon up Saranir. And then we're going to go ahead and metal morph the crap out of that thing into the full metal dragon. And then, uh, yeah, you have to tribute a level uh, five or higher to special this. But uh, we can negate an activation of an opponent's card effect and inflict damage to your opponent equal to one of their highest monsters on the field. And keep in mind, we are equipped with this now. So, Terror Baby's gonna go ahead and banish. We can't do anything really in response to our opponent's cards, but we're gonna go ahead and Pater, swing the thing on back. We still want our turn-ons. There's the banish, here comes the King's Sarcophagus. They'll go ahead and discard. All right, and then they're gonna go ahead and swing on into this, attempt to King Sark. We're gonna go ahead and negate that. And they're gonna go ahead and attempt to Emsedi here, which, okay. Interesting. All right, and then down comes the Rook, or the Rogue Doll, and then we're gonna start Gimmick Puppet plays. Go ahead and grab the Argent Chaos Force off of the deck here. Argent Chaos rank on up. All right, go ahead and get the Detach. We're gonna go ahead and attempt to Baldrake here. We don't want that thing doing its thing, but they're gonna go ahead and pop it off. Free damage, I suppose. Go ahead and get the Mill here. All right, just making sure of everything. We're gonna go ahead and Puppet of Strings. Go ahead and rank on up into Giant Hunter. Giant Hunter, go ahead and pop that. That's a lot of burn damage. All right, go ahead and revive the Dispater. Go ahead and banish. Set back up Foolish Burial on down the Fiendish Knight. Go ahead, Recurability on back to the hand. Go ahead and make the Link 2. Go ahead and grab the Rogue Doll. All right, special on down. Go ahead and make the Puppet. All right, revive Argent Chaos back into hand. Puppet, and pass those good old string counters around and then end the game. Whew. Whew, you know, it's a lot of work there, but you did get to see some pretty spicy interactions from our gimmick puppet player here. I played that very beautifully. And I will tell you, Dragon Link fundamentally did what Dragon Link does. You know, it had the Heavenly Spheres, you had the Omni, you had the Dispater. I would say that was an above opening hand for, you know, what this deck wants to do some games. All right, we're gonna go ahead and Lubellion discard. Go ahead and grab our Saranir from the deck. All right, ooh, free fodder. Collab Serpent on in to the Striker Dragon. I love opening up the one of my 60 card pile. Go ahead and get the Boot Sector launch here. All right, Wyvern Buster, go ahead, rotate. There is the Dragon Ravine off of the ROM. Standard stuff, go ahead and Dragon Ravine discard. Abzerouter at our free rocket. All the little combo extensions. Bice Steel, go ahead and banish. Step on into this, make the Heavenly. 
Sarnir, Banish, Arthur, Lubellion, Fiendish, Engraver time. Go ahead and grab the track so we can go search for Lurie. Mill off Lurie. Lurie special. Standard Fiend Smith combo. Alright, go ahead and rotate on in to, yes, this is the Scarlet Sorrow. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to drop down another Engraver here. Alright, Engraver, go ahead and tuck on back. Special. Go ahead and link on in to Sequentia. Sequentia, go ahead, tuck on back for the fusion on in to the Lacrima here. Now, this is where things get kind of dirty. So, you have some burn damage. It's about to trigger here with our Angel of Blue Tears. I will talk about that in a second here. So, there's the SP. We're going to go ahead and burn our opponent by tucking back. And now, this is where this card, in all of its MVP glory, actually comes in. It says, if effect damage is inflicted, banishes from your graveyard, set a normal trap card directly from your hand or deck. Oh my, what in the world are we actually going to set from the deck? Oh, yes. The different dimension ground here. This is the free force turn skip that you want to see against something like Gimmick Puppet because now Gimmick Puppet literally cannot. <laughs> it's uh, a little bit disappointing. Down comes the boot sector here. Go ahead and continue our extension. Rock it on up into our secondary friend. By Steel, go ahead and banish. All right, we'll go ahead and make the dissipator. Ooh. Hey, look at this. Here's the Pisty. Okay. Go ahead and rotate, and we're going to go ahead and make the Triple Burst. Oh, we have some zones available here. Go ahead and get our Darkness Metal. Darkness Metal extend on down. There's the Lubellion getting us our Regained. And then we're going to go ahead, and we're going to make the Boral End here on the final stack up. All right, we're going to go ahead and get the Red Eyes Full Metal here. Full Metal, go ahead and set this. And you know what? This is uh this is pretty good. Also, uh, extra note here: the enhanced metal morph makes it so your opponent cannot target the monster that this is equipped to, basically, uh, with monster or spells effects. Uh, that's why your opponent couldn't really do anything to it earlier because you have the enhanced protection of the metal morph. All right, Dispater on back. Hello, Baldrake. Welcome back. And pass turn. So now. We're gonna go ahead, we're gonna go ahead and tribute our Abso Router here so we can go ahead and get our Omni up and running here. The Abso Router will go ahead and trigger. We'll get a free Rocket Tracer, and uh, yeah, our opponent's hitting the Concede button. I'm sorry, but like, you're not beating Different Dimension Ground, a Boral, Sa or Boral M, you know, the Heavenly Spheres, uh, an Omni, like, that, that, was, that was some pretty disgusting stuff, and that was all relatively easy to accomplish for this deck, so. We're heading on in to game number three. And I see that we've opened up Perulia, the Save Ford, the Regained, the Bysteel, and the Lacrima here. Meanwhile, we have Rogue Doll called by. Ooh, we have the Salvation. Oh no, we have the good card. Okay, let's see what we can cook up here. I'm going to Perulia. Alright, they're going to go ahead and deploy the Scissor Arms. Interesting. Alright, Scissor Arms, go ahead. Mill off, sure. Terror Baby. Go ahead and deploy the Rogue. All right, go ahead and get the special. All right, go ahead and get the mill off there. We're gonna go ahead and buy steel, remove that. That's a pretty good detour. All right, go ahead and argent search here. All right, so we have a buy steel up, which is good. Go ahead and make the puppet. All right, rogue doll on back to hand here. We'll go ahead and grab the fiendish knight here. We just gotta not like die is the whole plan here. All right, we get, ooh, we got a phantasmia off of that. Too bad they've used their only link monster for the turn. Here's the Puppet Strings loading on up here. Go ahead and Argent Chaos Force rank on up. We're going to go ahead and pop that. Adrius is uh, pretty uh, helping us out there. So, I mean, they had to end on Dark Strings with the Puppet Strings with a Cold by set. So, we didn't lose. Good. Now we can play the game. Go ahead and get Cold by Well, you know, it's fine. We have a Vice deal to go ahead and step over that. And we're going to get Belt. Okay, well, never mind. We didn't need that anyway. Let's go ahead and... Make rocket plays. Go ahead and grab the boot sector. Yep, 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 yep. Deploy. Special. Go ahead. Make the dragon ravine searcher. Yep, yep, yep. Deploy the ravine. Mill off. All right. Hi, Lubellion. All right. Go ahead and mill off Levy in here. Levy. Go ahead. Add back our free value. Regained. Tuck on back. Get our free draw. Oh my gosh, we drew an attract. Mill off engraver. Make requiem. Go ahead and deploy the Levy in here. And we're going to go ahead and clear these on up. All right, go ahead, engraver, equip. Go ahead and get that thing off my field. All right, and then we just have to deal some damage here. Sequentia, go ahead and fuse on into Lacrima. Lacrima, get the free revive. Yep, and that's all that they wrote. 
Good stuff to drag and ravine here. This is actually a really good game. I, I quite enjoyed this. So please, leave a comment down below. Tell me what you guys think. I'll see your beautiful faces back in the day, guys. Peace. Patrons, thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Check out these other videos.